Hello friends, welcome back. Uh, our card drop down is ready. We have four products in our card drop down. Whenever we click on this, fetch all the data. So now I'm going to work on this card page, the card checkout. Yeah, and there we can remove products, we can add products automatically with the help of Ajax and check query method. So let's start. Let's create a new page. Control N and come to the index page start copy so this is our product from here to copy talk html, HTML type so copy and come here test and rest to save card.php save Close our UL tag and body tag. This is a UL tag close and close tip. This tip also. Body is already closed. So let's uh, run this. So come to the page and take some breaks in Paratag. this two three times depends upon you so div class equals to container hyphen fluid close this container another class div class equals to raw so this class div class equals to call happen empty happen two this paste one more time change it to 8 now we have 12 columns Dave class equals to panel panel hyphen primary close this step Class equals to panel icon heading close this tip paste paste change it to body and this to footer panel body give a uh, what so give a uh, div class within body a raw close this div div class equals to call hyphen md hyphen 2 close this and copy its five time 4 
six, eight, ten, twelve. Give panel heading. Card. Check out. Card check out. And here give action. Product. refresh it so we have card checkout action product image product name price quantity so so copy this raw one more time keep this in bold tab product image name quantity price in dollar so remove this action and add a button new button actually not button uh, give a tip tag class of you can keep two buttons together within this class so a close this a href equals to btn btn hyphen danger and copy this paste Change it to uh, primary and give a span class equals to glyph icon if I can trash close this span tag this is a button with class danger and it has a uh, icon uh, with glyph icon which is trash for means it looks like delete button so copy this it here glyph and change it to glyph icon ok sign it's for update just save it and come to the browser I refresh 
so we have two button like this I have done a mistake and actually this is not this is href copy this and add a class put it in here cut paste it here let's save this and refresh now it's okay so come here and move down remove this product image and add a img class img src equals to product underscore images slash images dot j p g and in this product name product price input type equals to text class equals to form hyphen control value equals to and it is actually price 5000 and this double copy this entire paste it here one price in dollar price in dollar like the zoom and disable let's save this and refresh so we have a product image product name and product price 5000 quantity 1 price in dollar we actually we need to this is a quantity so we need to remove this disable button and because we can increase or decrease quantity value 1 and this is price 5000 and total of one product is also 5000 save it and refresh now we here we can increase or decrease our product so thanks for watching friends uh, meet you in the next part don't forget to like and subscribe